Welcome to Finding Bliss. I think it's like 22 or something. That's great. Um, <clears throat> today's is uh, is pretty good. It's uh, like a check back at uh, the last couple that we've done about um, not caring what other people think about you and how you can just move on from that. But this one might make you think maybe I should care. Um, so, there it is. How would you your behavior change if you were only concerned about looking good to God? So, really understanding that we are all a piece of God, and then so like every person that you're with is a piece of God, and you should be treating each person as if they're that special of the being, you know, and that that's how your behavior should possibly be all the time, um, as much as possible, I guess. Um, and I just, I would try to think like, what if God came over for dinner and how would I be acting then? How would my behavior change? Um, would I change much or a lot or, um, would I know that he didn't really care what my house looked like, how the dinner tasted, or what I looked like? He would just be pretty much focusing on my light and how strong it was. And, um, and so thinking that, thinking that maybe we should just behave as if God was with us all the time. And you know, I would I would sit up straight, I would I would watch my words, I would probably cuss on accident because I do that when like yesterday I went to church to give a talk again. <laughs> and then now they want me to go talk at a tin sleep church too. It's like, oh boy, this is turning into something, but it's it's good and it's hopefully helpful to others and then um, get more people coming to our addiction recovery um, classes. So anyway, just behaving um, as if God was around and you were trying very hard to be your very best. And that's, that's like the fourth agreement. Always do your best. And Maybe always pretend that God is near and that you want to be impressing him or the people that are gifted to you during the day as um, as a, a, a pawn in your path or on your game board. This is someone for you to deal with in, in a very kind way. And uh, I have a... Or my husband has this customer in a little tiny, tiny town of Kirby, Jibo area. And this guy is so nice. Every time we pull up, he's like, hello, how are you? Thank you for coming. It's so nice to see you every time. Oh my goodness. He's so sweet to just to approach and be near. So, um, uh, if we could all act like that with each person. And I try very hard when um, I'm walking out to meet a customer to make sure I'm smiling. And um, a lot of times I say aloha because they've all just got back from vacation or something. And I'm a smart aleck. But uh, um, anyway, trying, try to imagine that. Try to imagine your day of bumping into God with every person that comes to your path and um and just being on your best behavior because really god is with you all the time so all right friends i love you have a great day trust that i mean it you know who i'm talking to i love you bye